Hey y'all, Morgan here. My first time in my shop in the past several weeks. I was on vacation, ended up sick. And I've been down sick since I got back. I had this axe waiting for me. And today is just going to be a little unboxing. Clear all that off. Let's I actually don't even remember what is <laughs> what's in the package. Probably another Collins axe. When you use a Collins axe, to open it. We'll take it easy since I don't know how they packed it and how it will. I mess anything up. Actually, yeah, looks like a newish handle. It's a good start. Yeah, maybe not all that new. All right, let's see. I hope you're all doing well. Projects done. Enjoying the lead up to spring, hopefully. The nice weather that comes with it. We went from actually a pretty mild winter up here in New England. We went from a bit rainy and 40s when we left, went down to Florida for a couple weeks and it was actually rainy down there, but the temperature difference, unreal. <clears throat> Let's see, what is this? 30, 3106, that's probably a lot number or something. Item number, online auction. So it was, it was actually fairly cool while we we're there for what's typical. So it was like rainy and in the 60s. <clears throat> and like I said, we ended up sick while down there. But it's nice to feel to relax in the warmer temps, not have to worry about loading up the wood stove, keeping things going for a couple weeks. Yeah, wow, that is a extremely loose fit. Kind of weird. I don't know if you can make that out from there. I'll try to get a couple close-ups here. It's a nice handle. I do like it. It's got plenty of room to to fit that swamper. Looks like. Boy, that, that one side is quite worn. Oof. Not too happy about that. It's hard to see from pictures when you're buying something online. Collins Legitimus. Yeah, decent. Probably a three, three and a half pound head. Three and a half pound head, probably. Got one little wormhole in the handle. Otherwise, in decent shape. Cracky fissure, whatever you want to call it, on the end. And uh, one flat spot. Crack isn't radiating up, so not an issue that I, as far as I'm concerned. So they definitely did glue the, the wedge in. It's just funny how they beveled the top of the handle <clears throat> inside of the eye so it sits down in. Kind of weird. So I'll see if I can drill that wedge out, reshape it, reseat it the rest of the way, clean up the head a little bit better. And, uh, do a little testing of that baby. Yeah, pretty straight handle. Not bad, not a bad score. Just had to wait a few weeks to get back. It ended, it ended up being a little bit of a delay in shipping. I purchased it before I left. It arrived after I left already, so been waiting on picking this up. <clears throat> had somebody pick it up and hold it for me, so been waiting a couple weeks to see this thing. Totally forgot what I had bought. 
So despite the lack of good fitment, I'm very happy with the purchase. Love the Collins Legitimus axes. This one, you know, it's hard to tell if that's upside down or not with that swamper pattern. I almost think it is still a little upside down. Maybe I'm wrong. Um, yeah, anyways. Get a few close ups here. Thank <laughs> you. 